feelings and what they feel and all. Really? And I'm so glad that Glorilla um made this um album. Tasha Cobbs, aka Miss 3D Live TV, I believe some of you may know her as um a fellow blogger. She went live this morning and she said a lot. A lot of that she said I totally agree with. But something that caught my attention was when Miss Netta came up in some of the statements that she made. I find it a little mm, I don't know, is it hypocritical? Is it is it hypocritical maybe because she speaks about understanding being poked and poked and poked and then you're responding um and things like that but she does not give that same grace to miss netta now she also says that it's nothing personal it's just business but she also criticizes people for supporting miss netta's business you guys check out this highlight and let me know your thoughts Leave it in the comment section below and make sure you like, share, and follow for more content like this. Because this baby don't understand that she is going to be the bridge between us young and old. A lot of what Gorilla was saying in that album, we've been trying to tell y'all. But see, it was the messenger. Sometimes it be the messenger. I understand I ain't. The, I might not be the right messenger for people. You know? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not the aesthetic. I'm not a, um, uh, I'm not a, a fair skinned woman. Uh, you, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't have no ass. I got a little bit. It's coming, you know, you know, I don't have a Coke bottle shape. You know, none of that. I don't, I don't have the, 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 the you know, I, I do got the TikTok bed and stuff. It's just in the box up in there. I ain't got it. But I don't have the aesthetic. So sometimes when I say something, it, it don't come across as, as how it would be with other people. And I'm okay with that. The Lord puts in front of me who, who I need to be in front of. And sometimes it be so crazy to me that I, I be thinking, this person watch me? I be like, what? I watch them. So I leave it at that. I leave it at that. I'm not going to sit up here and cry, whine, beg nobody for no views. I'm not going to buy no views. I'm not going to go out and it, um, um, expose my family's deepest, darkest secrets so y'all can get on this internet and tear us to pieces. Because that's what you do to people. You want people to be vulnerable. But they got to get on here and they got to be going through Damn near hell. You got to see a person damn near dying on here for y'all to, 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 to quote unquote help. Or the person can be overly rich. It's what I don't understand. People on here rich and y'all sending them gifts. Y'all on here sending them gifts. Y'all on here supporting them buying they liquor. Buying they liquor. Every time they put out a liquor, you out there buying it. Putting it in their parking. I know some of us in, the, in 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 our community, we don't be doing right with money and sales and stuff. But guess what? Them other D clear folks be doing the same thing. They just be doing it under the table. We just don't figure out they to the back end. That's it. So sometimes you gotta you gotta weather the storm. Listen, this is my homegirl's establishment. She ain't got too much help right now to take her too, a little, little, little too long to get stuff done. But I'm still going to rock with her because when she get to the level that she get to where she can have some help up in here and people going to be helping her and stuff, she going to be amazing. And I'm going to be right here because guess what? I, I, stayed, I, I, I stayed on the course with her. And that's what we have to do with some just like the cookie lady. Y'all sit up there. Them folks sit up there and talk crazy about that lady. Look at her now. Now she got the support that because, because it had to be a drama behind it for us to get behind this lady. And then y'all will go and support somebody like Netta that sits up and imitates us, talks crazy about us and to us. Because this is the thing. You, you, you categorize black women, but then you say you love them, you love them, but you don't like all of them, right? But the way that you treat is, is that you don't like none of them. You see what I'm saying? But people will still, will still sit up and then you play, you playing, and you play in folks face. You, you know what I'm saying? You, you said, right, the pain and the toxicity attracts, uh, yes, it does. It does attract attention. You said actions speak louder than words. What you mean by that? That's what I say. I say that too. 
I've, I've, listen, and, and my moderator will tell you, she on her, my moderator will tell you, I have tried my best to steer clear of even a lot of situations. Because it's unnecessary. It's it's not worth one. It's not worth my time. I'm not gonna keep sitting up here going back and forth with nobody that I don't know. You know, because we're all on this internet just trying to make money. That's it. It's nothing personal. It's all business for me. I promise you. I don't know you for it to be personal, baby. And that goes on for anybody that I talk to on this internet. It is all business. Unless we develop a relationship that's personal. Because I'm developing relation, per, personal relationships with my mods. Because I love my mods. And I want my mods to understand that when, when I blow up, you blow up. We all gonna blow up. This not no oh you just over here, you know helping Miss Tosh. No, this is this something we all getting up here together. <laughs> Hell, I got a mind that got more followers than me. So again, that's where I'm at with it. I'm at I'm I'm I, I be on here trying to help other people, and and and, and I ain't even finished helping myself yet, y'all. To be honest with you. But that's how you know my heart is genuine. Like, I don't be doing no shot of spite. I start doing shit when I feel like I'm just playing with my motherfucking feelings. Or if they playing with my empathy. Or they playing with my emotions. And you sitting up here trying to... You you steady throwing shade uh, dookie nuggets at me. And thinking that I ain't gonna say nothing. I don't say nothing to protect you and me. Because well, I already know what type of person you is. It's a lot of y'all on here that like to dox. And again, you don't have to dox a bang over here. I will tell you, but if you're trying to dock something to embarrass me, you could never embarrass me because I want to tell my story. I just feel like people don't want to hear it because it's too similar to the stories that you have seen. But that's what I why I want to tell them that even though you got a similar story, baby, you can make your story different. Your story can end different. I promise you it can. I'm a product of it. Your story can end different. It might begin a way. It might begin to fuck away in the in the, in the projects in the P, but I promise you, it's gonna end a different way. You said, uh, yes, a story worth telling. Hey, you are funny, beautiful, and amazing. I appreciate you, baby T. I appreciate that. I don't I don't be worried about what people say about me. That that's never my concern. My my issue is is when you you think that you gonna keep saying and I'm not gonna respond to you. That I'm gonna respond eventually. That's just like you sitting up poking the alligator. Eventually, the alligator going to snap at your ass. Poking a bear. Eventually, the bear is going to snap at you. If you poke at a dog, it's going to snap at you. So, don't you think if you keep poking at a human, they're going to say something to you? I would think they would. If they don't, hell, they're an alien. Thank y'all for the follows. I appreciate y'all. Girl, that's what I be saying. I'm, uh, I have a, a, a home. I don't care how, when there is a home for me and my kids. Period. Do you hear me? Period. People be so hard up on, on aesthetics and trying to make sure look the way it look. I promise you, majority of these people on this internet that be acting like they got their shit together, they don't. They only showing you one corner of their mouth is for a reason. I take y'all all around this raggedy apartment. You hear me? Because one, I'm trying to get y'all to help me decorate this. As soon as I get some money on, as soon as I get this big check to drop, I'm going to get on her and I'm going to show y'all the whole apartment. And I need y'all to help me decorate because I can't decorate. I can't. I can't decorate, friends. And I be looking at y'all stuff and y'all stuff be looking so cute. And I know some of y'all be doing it on the budget. So for my friends, I need y'all to help me decorate.